With temperatures dropping rapidly in the Gulf, the weather becomes a matter of life and death for a gem of South Padre Island, sea turtles. As a result of that, they can't move their flippers, so they float to the top of the water. And even though their instinct tells them and they're awake and they know they're supposed to lift their head to breathe, they can't. Going through what's known as a cold stun, the turtles become lifeless. Some bob in the water, others wash ashore. Wendy Knight, executive director of Sea Turtle Inc., says they're doing everything they can to help as many turtles as they can. Hundreds being brought into the South Padre Island Convention Center by volunteers on the water and beaches. A big mix in the 1500 different sea turtles in here. As you can see, some of the larger ones, the older ones, they take a little longer to thaw out, if you will. But this guy right here, right in front of Albert, he's already moving. He's trying to get back out to the water doing what he naturally does. But unfortunately, out of all the turtles that have been brought here over the last couple days, not all of them are going to share that luck. Sea Turtle Inc. is prepared for these events. But Knight says the power issues compounded by time in the water has already caused losses. Uh, today we're seeing really severely cold stunned and a, a lot more DOA arrivals. Uh, just again because of the longevity, this is kind of unprecedented weather for this area. And it's not just new rescues in danger. Residents at the nonprofit like Merry Christmas, Allison, the first sea turtle to ever have a prosthetic after losing three limbs, and Hang Ten, dry docked to warm them up. We do dry dock when they're ill, especially. So like the cold stuns, as we discussed, if we put them in water now, they would drown. Um, so this is really something you do for a sick animal, um, and Hang Ten's not sick. And as creatures of habit, accustomed to an exact schedule, places like the employee bathroom and small tubs to keep warm is wearing on their mental and physical health.